Hey guys, Joe here at JP Details and today's video is all about this 2016 Audi S7 and what a beast of a car it is. The only thing letting the S7 down is the exhaust tips, all four of them. So this video didn't go quite as I planned. I didn't expect the exhaust tips to be as bad as they are considering the car hasn't even covered 8,000 miles. I was pretty confident at the start about returning the tips to an immaculate condition which unfortunately didn't turn out to be the case. So in today's video you can watch me molest the exhaust tips on the S7 and get the best possible finish by hand. Before you go jumping to the comments section about polishing bits for a drill, I'm fully aware this would have made my life 10 times easier and I have been meaning to purchase a drill and polishing accessories for a while. I just haven't been required recently to polish any bad exhaust tips. So if you have any recommendations on some good drill polishing accessories, then let me know in the comment section below. Once I'm sorted with the drill, I'll be back with a video doing it properly. So the first few steps for the exhaust, whether you're using a drill or wire wool, clean them up the best you can. I'm using Meguiar's degreaser diluted 6 to 1, a 4 inch wheel brush, an old microfiber cloth and also a smaller inner wheelbarrow brush. The main road contamination found on most exhaust tips are blobs of road tar which are easily removed using a tar and glue remover and a microfiber cloth. It may take 2 or 3 hits with giving the products 30 seconds to a minute to dwell to fully remove all road tar. I'll follow the initial cleaning and decontamination stage with a final clean using Meguiar's degreaser and rinse the areas down using a garden hose. I'll then dry the tips using a fresh microfiber cloth before moving to the polishing stage. Using a fine grade automotive designed wire wool and Meguiar's metal polish, I'll apply a generous amount of polish to the wool and work into all affected areas. Throughout the whole process, I'll ensure the wire wool stays lubricated with polish so no damage or deep marking is inflicted to the stainless steel exhaust tips. The problem I found with doing this by hand was the pure fact I couldn't build up enough friction on the severely stained areas. My arms and hands were tiring out with the constant scrubbing whilst applying pressure, so I've cut down 80% of the footage and put in the highlights of me getting to a stage where I was reasonably satisfied with the finish.
Just like machine polishing paintwork where you'll do a medium to heavy stage cut first to remove the imperfections, although in this case we're removing stubborn exhaust soot, you'll need to follow the wire wool stage with a milder refining stage. For this I'm using a microfiber applicator and the same Meguiar's metal polish. I'll work it into all areas of the exhaust two or three times to ensure any fine marks from the wire wool are removed. After each pass I'll buff the exhaust with a fresh microfiber cloth and inspect the result. I'll continue doing this until I'm satisfied with the finish. The story behind the S7 is that it's being returned back from a lease so it wasn't important for the exhaust tips to be 100%. The objective was to return them back to a respectable standard which I've managed to achieve. I'll be back with a professional exhaust polishing guide in the future once I've got myself sorted with a drill and some polishing accessories. I'll leave you with an engine startup and a few revs. Please drop the video a like, subscribe to the channel and I'll hopefully catch you in the next one.